YouTube, YouTube, YouTube. Reddit drops 11%. Now, thank you guys for tuning into the Life Changing Finances YouTube channel. Make sure you guys like, share, and subscribe. Now, Reddit has been on an absolute tear since its inception date. And we finally have a day where we're cooling off. You can see this big red candle that I'm going to show you here on the chart is what started it all. So, so we fought, you know, to maintain the consolidation at about 65. We showed a level of weakness coming down to 64, and then we just let it go from there. Now, there was some buying uh, that came as a result of this. So it's a possibility we will have a, a retrace of the all-time highs. But with this being a new stock, you know, it just kind of remains to be seen. We don't really have much history on this particular stock. Now, <clears throat> these are the levels that I have set. Um, and I haven't touched this since the, the stock came out. Now, we can see that we came below $62, which was a level of support. We came down, um, but we closed above that next level of support, which is $54 and about 54 cents. So we're still doing okay. So we'll see what happens tomorrow. If we can swing back up, show a level of support above 6206, and then maybe we can retrace those all time highs. Otherwise, the next leg, leg down is going to be $54.46. If we can't find strength there, you know what time it is. We come into $50 and about 98 cents. Okay. And for a bid, if we came to $50.98, According to history, it's going to be a sharp drop to $0.45. Cent, $45, I'm sorry. Now, the way I'm, I'm going to play this thing out is I'm going to sit back and wait. Um, personally, my buy zone, personally, to buy the stock outright is going to be under $45, right? Now, where that kind of remains to be seen, too, Um I'd like to get it at this point at where it started at with the, with the IPO, $34 a share. That's my fair value. I don't give financial advice, but that's where I would be looking to capitalize on this. Now, as earnings come out, you know, as more news, more big players want to get into this stock and they start playing games uh, of actually putting bad news out to drop the stock, you know that somebody's going to start buying this thing up. Now, um, you have to understand the cycles. You have to understand the games they play, and you got to stay on top of it. Now, whatever strategies you have, stick to it. Um, if you're going to get into this right now, make sure you guys have a tight stop loss, okay? Don't come in here willy-nilly like it's a casino. Have a strategy, execute it. Use your tools that are available to you. Use your stop loss, okay? If you're in profit, do not be afraid to take profit. Don't think this thing is going to continue to just go up and not stop, okay? So let me know what you guys think about Reddit. Um, do you think this is going to be a nice long-term stock? Do you foresee a big player may or maybe buying Reddit out? I know Kathy Wood and her firm has, has bought Reddit, um, so... That may or may be it may or may not be a good sign. That remains to be seen as well. So let me know what you think of the state of Reddit. Can we get over this drop? Let me know in the comments below. Make sure you guys like, share, subscribe, and we're out. Peace.